You know, a major construction day for West Sacramento as it breaks ground on a project to connect the north and south sides of the city. It'll connect Evergreen Avenue just south of Joey Lopes Park to the Virtual Academy of Washington Unified. That's just off of Clarendon Street. KCR3's Melanie Wingo joins us now live to explain what it'll do for pedestrians and cyclists. Melanie, good morning. Good morning. Well, this is pretty exciting because what we're seeing behind us is just a wall right now, but wait, it will get better in just two years time. The wall behind us will make way for a pedestrian and bicycle bridge that will connect people from one part of West Sacramento to the other side without them having to go by car. And that is the purpose behind the Sycamore Trail Extension Project. Phase two of that project set to get off the ground in just about an hour. West Sacramento City leaders will officially kick off the start of this phase of the project, which will construct that new pedestrian and bicycle bridge over US 50. The project will include landscaping, lighting, park features, and some decorative fencing along the bridge to welcome drivers to the city of West Sacramento as they go under that overpass. The city saying this artery will be a great way for people to get around and get out of their cars. Something city leaders say they're committed to helping people do for their health and for the environment. Mobility first and, and alternatives to, you know, get people around, but uh, also for the environment, get cars off the road so we can create these avenues and trails for that that'll encourage our population to, to take advantage of some of this and, and get some of the pollution out of the air. So this has been a five phase project. Phase one of the project was completed in 2019. Phase two, which starts today, is scheduled to be complete by summer of 2024. And that groundbreaking that will sort of get the party started, that is happening at 10 o'clock this morning. We'll be there. Reporting live in West Sacramento, Melanie Wingo, KCRA 3 News.